there is no shortcut in real estate. If you want to make money, there is a lot of money, but you got to put in the effort. My name is Anil Jintrukar. I have a team at Douglas Salomon called the Jintrukar team. Uh, we have six people working in our team and we specialize in luxury market in New York City. I came to New York City from Sydney, Australia in 2016. I had about four hotels, nightclub, um, conference center, cocktail bar. I had like 100, 150 people working for me. And during the 2008 global financial crisis, I lost everything and then I came here. No friends, no family here. I started with nothing. I was almost broke. I spent most of the money I brought from Australia, but I knew in my mind that I can sell. All I did was start calling people. Zanil, yeah, are you thinking of selling? It used to take so much time for me. But buyers can be a very long-term game. I know that not everybody is working with me, but at least the pipeline I have, if I don't nurture them, I could be losing money. As much as I could do, I work seven days a week, 16 hours a day. Okay, I mean, I think I can only go so long, you know what I mean? Some of those buyers are sitting in my database, but I'm not, I wasn't servicing them. And I got like almost 8,000 leads in there. And I put them onto the localized OS and then let them take over from there and send them the, the listings. And if there is a connection come through and if they want to see an apartment, they just reach out to me and then I'll take it from there, it's very easy. I don't have to do anything. I just downloaded my CRM, I uh, send the Excel file, and the team just uploaded it for me, all done. Now I can spend more time on the sellers. I still think human touch is important. The AI is doing some initial work to get the interest, and then a human is getting involved. Every call has been recorded, they ask all the right questions. So I don't even have to tell them anything. Technology is going to be a deal breaker for agents who will not use the technology. I think they will be losing the business to the agents who are adopting to the new technology.